sound of great jazz, and this festival plays an important role in the social and cultural atmosphere of our city. On behalf of Toronto City Councilor and Mayor Rob Ford, I do hereby proclaim June 22nd to July 1st, 2012 as Jazz Week in the City of Toronto. Congratulations. Thanks, Josh and Councillor Crawford. My name is Rob Fogel. I do a show on CHRY, and it's my honor again to be here the 22nd year in a row that I've been introducing some of these characters. You've got some of the funniest guys in jazz in this band. <laughs> anyway, we would also like to thank City TV for making today's concert possible. Culturally diverse, city focused, and intensely local, City TV's landscape is a great fit for our festival artists. That's why City TV is the official television broadcaster of the TD Toronto Jazz Festival. Watch and relive your favorite festival memories on City News at City TV and City News Channel. Throughout the festival, we encourage you to keep your phones on but on silent, please, and tweet us, follow us at Toronto Jazz Fest, or mention us with our hashtag number TD Music. Also be sure to drop by the HMV tent tomorrow at 5 p.m. for an autograph signing session with Canadian legend Peter Appleyard and two of his sophisticated ladies, Diana Panton and Emily Claire Barlow. And now City TV with the Duke Ellington Society presents today's after work concert. The gentleman on drums joined the Musicians Union when he was three years old and he's been playing with them since. He's been president. He has his own festival that he puts on in Prince Edward County. You're going to hear some fantastic music today. Here's Brian Barlow and the Duke Ellington Orchestra, the Brian Barlow Orchestra. wonderful to see you all here this evening, this afternoon. It still feels like afternoon to me. So, I want to begin by giving a great big thank you to the Toronto chapter of the Duke Ellington Society. Um, a lot of the uh, movers and shakers are sitting down in the front row here and uh, they have contributed to this concert. And uh, But more than that, they have really contributed to keeping the music of Duke Ellington alive in Toronto for many, many decades, and uh, it's a great organization. I'm a member, as are many of the guys in the band, and uh, 
So do, do check them out. They're on Facebook. Uh, they have a website, the Toronto chapter of the Duke Ellington Society. Thank you very much.